What's happening guys? Praying Mantis back with you again with another video. Today I'm gonna be talking about the current diet and the workout plan that I do. So let's start with the diet plan. At the moment, I do intermittent fasting. Since I've done so many diets before, carb cycling, I've done six small meals a day, I've done carb loading, low carb, high carb diets. I've tried so many diets and at the moment I'm trying to do intermittent fasting. What intermittent fasting is, you restrict yourself from eating for a certain amount of hours and then you eat all of your cal calories within a small, smaller hour window. Instead of waking up at like six in the morning and starting your breakfast and having your last meal at about 10, in the evening or whatever you have your calories within six or eight hour window that's what i do personally that's what i prefer let's say i start my meals at two in the afternoon and then i finish all of my meals at around eight or ten so i leave myself six or eight hour window to eat all my calories and my meals are really really big i was always a big eater I always liked food I always liked eating large meals that's why this diet is so good because it allows me to eat larger meals and eat meals that are more satisfying rather than eating six smaller meals and feeling a bit hungry constantly <clears throat> i've been doing this diet for about three weeks it does take time for your body to adapt to it but once it does you won't actually feel a much of a difference during your fast you're allowed to uh, drink zero calorie beverages or black coffee that's what i do at the moment I'm just sipping on my black coffee right now and water yeah just make sure you keep yourself hydrated avoid eating those foods during your fast keep your insulin levels at the baseline so what it does your body uses your fats for energy rather than your carbohydrates because your body prefers carbohydrates as a primary energy source anyway so when you have no carbohydrates in your body and you're in a fasted state and even when you train your body has a higher chance of using your fat cells for energy so it's a really really good diet for fat loss and you keep you literally keep your insulin levels low within 16 or 18 hours as long as you fast so you give your body more time to use your body fat as fuel so second thing is my workout routine uh, i've done a lot of workout routines as well so i tried the bro split one body part a week that didn't really work well i would feel that my muscles would recover quick enough for another workout i changed it to push pull legs that was quite good actually i quite enjoyed that routine but i was always keen on finding other techniques that would work for me even better so I did chest and back together and then shoulders and arms separately and then legs separately it was six day workout plan but I would only hit my legs once a week because I would feel they won't recover as quick as my other body part now I'm doing upper body lower body and then I rest on third day or I take active rest which is cardio so yeah uh, within my upper body days I would do my chest back shoulders and arms and on my lower day I would usually do my legs and I would also include my lower back because I want to strengthen my lower back a little bit more so I've been doing this workout for about three weeks now and it's been working quite well so I'm just gonna carry on with it the most importantly my strength has been going up so much which made me actually realize that this workout plan actually works with the intermittent fasting as well sometimes I train even fasted guys you don't even realize what kind of pump you get you're more focused your muscles are solid rock hard if I train fasted I take 10 grams of BCAs and then I take 10 grams of BCAs right after my workout just to preserve that muscle uh, from going into a catabolic state so yeah I think that's it for today guys uh, thanks for watching my video Thanks for all the support you've been showing me guys. Really, really appreciate it. It motivates me even more to push myself and to produce some more quality content for you guys. So thanks once again, guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.